Configuration of 18101. To enter the setup menu, press the menu key over the direct function keys. The setup key will only appear once the function key has been pressed. When the setup key has been pressed, the ECG settings and system settings will be displayed. To configure the ECG settings, select ECG. Various tabs will become available that will permit the configuration of those parameters. The first two tabs are to set the two automatic formats for printouts. In these tabs, you can select all the parameters regarding both. Under the Filter tab, there are five different filters which can be set individually as follows. The Baseline Filter, Myogram Filter, Mains Filter, Baseline Stabilizer Filter, and Smoothing Filter. If the interpretation is installed on the device, the Interpretation tab will appear. The Interpretation settings will enable the user to determine whether or not certain comments will be added to the interpretation statements on the ECG printout. The interpretation sensitivity can be set to high or low, which will suppress certain non-specific ECG diagnosis. Under age assumed to be, the patient's age range can be selected. This setting is only applicable when the patient data has not been entered. When a patient's date of birth has been entered, this setting is ignored. The option to have a statement saying abnormal ECG or unconfirmed report in the printout can be selected. If the thrombolysis software is installed, it can be turned on or off under this tab. Under the leads tab, the lead sequence can be selected, as well as defining the type of signal. The auto centering can be turned on or off, as well as the rhythm lead group. Under general, the auto storage can be set to automatic, manual, or off. This means that once a recording has been made, it will automatically be stored if set to automatic, and the automatic printout can be turned on or off as well as the automatic transmission. Under System Settings, you have several options. Under Unit, you have various parameters. The user ID is where the identification of the user is inserted. This identification is printed on all automatic recordings. The time, date, and language are defined under the Unit tab. Under Communications, all settings regarding the communication parameters are set. And under Test and Information, a code of the options installed is displayed after the software version.